Today I will share seven reasons why PlayStation surpasses Xbox as a home console, and why the PS5 should be your choice when purchasing. The first reason is exclusive games. The PS5 has more of them, and Sony invests significantly more resources into their development than most other companies. Just think of The Last of Us Part II, a game that surpasses almost all recent Xbox exclusives in quality and detail. Even if we set aside personal preferences and quality and just compare the number of exclusives on both platforms, Xbox falls behind again. In 2024, Sony released Helldivers 2, Final Fantasy Rebirth, Stellar Blade, and Rise of the Ronin. In contrast, Xbox's only significant release has been Kinshik Hellblade, and that's just a four-hour game. Moreover, all Xbox exclusives are released on PC on the first day and can be ported to PlayStation, so it's hard to even talk about true exclusives for Xbox. There's simply no point in buying this console for unique games. The second reason PlayStation surpasses Xbox is the localization of most games into foreign languages. Nearly all Sony exclusives on PlayStation have text translations into the necessary languages for specific countries, and games from internal studios receive high-quality dubbing. This is a huge advantage for players in countries like France and Germany. Even having subtitles in the required language is rare on Xbox, and many exclusives have to be played in English. Moreover, Sony collaborates with local publishers and voiceover studios to ensure high-quality translation and dubbing, making PlayStation games more accessible and enjoyable for players worldwide. This is especially important for those who do not speak English, but want to fully immerse themselves in the gaming experience without constantly needing to translate. Another advantage of PlayStation is the support for local cultural nuances and realities. For instance, in some regions, games are adapted to fit the local context, with jokes and elements added that are understandable and relatable to a specific audience. This creates a unique sense of connection and care for the users, significantly increasing loyalty to the brand. While Xbox remains more focused on the English-speaking market, PlayStation demonstrates a global approach. Considering the needs and preferences of players from different countries, this further highlights why PlayStation wins the hearts of gamers worldwide, offering them high-quality games and taking care of the comfort and convenience of users in each country. The third reason is that Sony's console is significantly more popular than Xbox. Of course, popularity alone doesn't make a console better, but with a larger fan base, the PS5 gains several advantages. More online activity on the PS5 makes it easier to find a team for games, and developers often focus on this platform. Since more people play on the PS5 and it generates more profit for developers, they tend to optimize games for Sony's console first, which often results in better performance on the PS5 and delays in releases on Xbox. For example, the DLC for Elden Ring performs better on the PS5 than on the more powerful Xbox, and the release of the Souls-like game Wukong was delayed on Xbox due to optimization issues. The popularity of the PS5 is especially important when you want to purchase accessories or games for the console. When you look at the second-hand market, you'll find that it's almost impossible to find the right disc for Xbox. They simply aren't available. For example, you might have to order a controller battery from another country, because local stores don't stock it due to low demand. And if you decide to sell your Xbox, you'll be surprised to find that there are few buyers, and without a substantial discount, it might take six months to make a sale. The fourth reason to choose Sony's console is the availability of physical discs. On PlayStation, all exclusives are always released in physical format, giving you the choice between digital and disc versions. However, this choice is often unavailable on Xbox, and most exclusives are only released digitally. The situation with discs on Xbox is getting worse each year. This year, there have already been reports of major international retailers refusing to sell Xbox discs, and Microsoft is gradually phasing out physical game releases, shifting to digital versions. 
If you value physical copies and want to own your games, Xbox is unlikely to be the right choice. The fifth reason for choosing PlayStation over Xbox is the controller. The DualSense from PlayStation is the most technologically advanced and tactilely pleasing controller on the market. In contrast, the Xbox controller is an outdated model with buttons copied from Nintendo, minimal functionality, and AA batteries power it. Additionally, the Xbox controller isn't self-sufficient. You must purchase either batteries or a detachable rechargeable battery to play, which adds extra costs. This seems absurd, especially when compared to the DualSense, which works perfectly right out of the box. The only advantages of the Xbox controller are its compatibility with most devices and ease of connection to a PC. However, this advantage is diminished by the fact that compatibility is due to its minimal functionality. Any budget controller from China will have the same compatibility with a PC as the expensive Xbox controller. The sixth reason why PlayStation surpasses Xbox is the availability of VR with Sony. There's really no debate here. PlayStation has virtual reality, while Xbox doesn't even have any hints of it on the horizon. PlayStation VR may seem expensive and unnecessary for everyone, but even if you have never used VR, the fact that it's available on PlayStation is an important advantage. It's great to know that with a PS5, you can always purchase a VR headset and, for example, immerse yourself in the world of Gran Turismo VR. Even if you have never used this feature, it's nice knowing you have the option. PlayStation VR offers unique opportunities for immersion in the gaming world unavailable on other platforms. For instance, games like Gran Turismo 7 VR or Resident Evil 7 Biohazard VR allow you to experience presence in virtual space and engage with the game from an entirely different perspective. The seventh reason to buy a PS5 instead of an Xbox is Microsoft's attitude towards Xbox as a gaming console. For Microsoft's leadership, Xbox has long ceased to be a promising product. They're more interested in Game Pass, game development, and investments in cloud technologies, but not in promoting the console itself. The Xbox series is just an additional component in Microsoft's ecosystem, which actually hinders the company from becoming a multi-platform publisher and earning revenue on Nintendo and Sony platforms. Previously, only industry insiders would talk about this, but now even Microsoft admits that it will increasingly focus on other platforms, gradually pushing Xbox and its exclusives into the background. Microsoft has expanded its gaming assets to such an extent that Limiting itself to PC and Xbox is impossible. If they don't actively move towards multi-platform, they will lose money and face management challenges with the studios they've acquired. In conclusion, buying an Xbox in 2024 means purchasing a lagging player in the console market. It's a console without unique exclusives, cutting-edge technologies, and a clear future. A console that neither game developers nor Microsoft itself seem interested in. The company even hints in its ads that you might be better off buying a controller and a modern Samsung TV to play Xbox games without needing to buy the console itself. If you're still undecided about which console to choose, I hope these seven reasons helped you decide about the PlayStation 5. Sony continues to delight its users with quality exclusives advanced technologies, and excellent localization. The PlayStation 5 looks much more attractive than its competitors, offering more possibilities and better games. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel, and share your opinion in the comments. Which console do you prefer and why? Good luck, enjoy gaming, and see you in the next video.